Hi, this is Steve Spence with green-trust.org and today we're going to be taking an inexpensive lantern style flashlight and converting it to LED. We're also going to be replacing the lantern style battery with rechargeable D cells. It's a really quick, easy conversion that you can do at home. First, we unscrew the top. This is a $4 flashlight from Walmart. Take out the incandescent light bulb and we're going to put in an LED light bulb that we got from Walmart or not from Walmart, I'm sorry, from Amazon and this is a 50 lumen bulb, they also come all in this is a 1 watt, the 3 watts are about 150 lumens you have to make sure you don't get the one that says it's for mag light because it's larger in diameter and won't fix the, fit the uh, fixture We snap that back together and now it's an LED. Now the next thing we're going to do is we're going to take out the old carbon zinc non-rechargeable battery and we picked up one of these little conversion boxes on the internet for about six bucks and this allows us to use regular D cells. In this case we're going to use nickel metal hydride D cells. These are 10 amps each so they will give this flashlight very very long life. And we just pop these in here according to the diagram inside that tells you which way to put the ends. And that's all it took to convert a non rechargeable to a rechargeable. Drop this into the flashlight, doesn't matter how it goes in there because there's a round contact on here. It does matter how this goes back into the flashlight because these two strips are aimed at the switch. Your brand of flashlight may change. We stick it in there and line it up and then screw the cap back on. Sometimes getting the threads aligned can be a little tricky. There we go. And now we've got a super bright LED rechargeable flashlight that will last hundreds of hours longer than the old combination and is easily rechargeable. We have an example of a recharger that will take triple A's, double A's, C's and D's and 9 volt rechargeable nickel metal hydrides and or nickel cadmium batteries. Uh, one of the neat things about this is it also has a USB port on the back so that you can also charge your USB um, charge devices like a Kindle or a cell phone or an MP3 player. The batteries will charge first and then once the batteries are charged then the device plugged into the USB port will then start charging once the batteries that are inside the unit are finished charging. This device has a 12 volt input on it. It comes with a one and a half amp adapter so this can easily be charged in the vehicle or you could even plug it into a solar panel and charge the batteries with solar as well. So that is our quick and easy conversion to a long life LED. The bulb will never burn out in this particular application. There's a voltage regulator in the bulb. Um, the batteries will last for years and are rechargeable hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of times. Uh, you should easily get uh, five to seven years easily out of these batteries. And um, it will they are very low discharge, self-discharge batteries, so if you have them sticking in a drawer for a year or so, they'll still have charge on them when you pop them into the flashlight. But, of course, they'll have a better charge if you are constantly uh, rotating the batteries in and out of service. So there you go. You can read more about this at www.green-trust.org. I'm Steve Spence. You can get hold of me at sspence at green-trust.org. And if you want the parts to put this together, uh, we can put together a kit for you. Talk to you later.